The analyzer in Mapping Tonal Harmony Pro can take a chord progression and produce a harmonic analysis. All you need to do is type the chord progression and let the analyzer do the rest. But if you're a more advanced player, you might want to tweak a few of the chords. Like in All of Me, the second chord is an E7 chord. And when I used the analyzer, it changed it to an E7 flat 9. And that's because the analyzer knows the best scale to pair a 506 with is a Mixo flat 9 flat 13. But if you want to force mapping Tonal Harmony Pro to use a regular E7 paired with the Mixolydian scale, how do you do that? I want to thank Steve Johns for such an excellent question. So here's how you do it. So let's say I want to change this E7 flat 9 in all of me to a regular E7. If you use the analyzer to replace the E7 flat 9 with an E7, you'll find out it won't. And that's because once the analyzer realizes that that E7 is a 5-7 of 6, it assigns the best chord scale to that E7, which is Mixolydian flat 9 flat 13, and changes it back to an E7 flat 9. So you must change it yourself using the map. Just tap on the E7 flat 9 that you want to change in the score, and it will show it on the map. You can tap and hold on that chord on the map, and a view with all possible chord scale and chord types will appear. Let's choose a regular E7 Mixolydian. Now simply tap on the E7 on the map to replace the E7 flat 9 in the score. Turn edit mode off, and then hit play to practice over your new chord progression. Thanks again to Steve for such an excellent question, and guys, please keep them coming. We're always working hard on making Mapping Tunnel Harmony Pro the best possible app for musicians. So if you have questions or ideas, please let us know in the comments down below, or send us an email to mdexmusic at gmail.com. Thanks again, and I'll catch you on the next video.